what kind of a profiles generally are there for designers overall in the market so uh, when i attended the imagine xp jump starter course it was a full ux course where it included so we know like ux is an entire like it's a process of different processes so it starts with research then you have task flows you have journeys wireframing prototyping then in the end you do user testing and you can pick out any of these particular streams so you can be a ux researcher you can be an interaction designer can be a, a usability tester so it's on you which profile you would like to have uh, what i did was like a a, a jump starter of all these a mix of all these courses and right now also like if i'm working as a consultant i have it's it doesn't matter like uh, no matter the title is if it says designer it doesn't mean that i'm just doing the ui part of it or the visual part of it i have to start with the research i need to go to that entire flow and that's how you get to the final design so i think if students are looking for like for their career perspective it's very important for them to understand each of these options that they have and then what is it that they want to pursue it's important for them to connect with it so some people enjoy talking to the use like talking to people talking to users and then getting to know their view so it can be good if they go for the research field because in the research you talk to so many different people you get to know their pain points you kind of get the requirements by talking to so many people so it can be good for them but if someone is really good at like creative thinking they're good at putting down the wireframes then interaction design can be one part of it so it's it's again from an individual point of view they have to uh, kind of know their strength kind of know what they are looking for and then go for that uh, particular course or uh, session